To do this correctly, what you want to do is have your pelvis in a locked position, sorry, your spine in a locked position. Your hips are the only place that you're hinging from this. This is also called a Russian deadlift or stiff-legged deadlift. From this position, you stick the chest out and butt out, find uh, neutral pelvis, cause a little bit more anterior pelvic tilt so that you lock in the spine there. And again, you're not moving up the pelvis. So you're doing this one once they've mastered the, the teaching technique of, of neutral spine or stable spine as they're squatting. So you're gonna do this with the bar just like this and locked in for the spine and you're only hinging at the hips so you slowly squat down until they feel a stretch in the hamstring. If they can get past their knees, then they're moving their spine. So I have fairly, I have decently flexible hamstrings and when I do this correctly, I get to here and that's a pretty good stretch. And so I should stop right there. So if I get any lower, this movement right here is all happening in my spine and so I could reach all the way to the floor, but then that's spinal movement. I want just hip movement. So we are just going down to the point where they feel hamstring stretch and then coming back up very slowly. And coming down in the back should stay locked. So if they can't do this exercise, let's put it this way, if they're not feeling hamstring stretch when they go below the knee, then they're moving their spine and they need to peel back. They need to do this one again so that they can do this correctly and then progress once that's mastered, then they can do the standing weighted version.